Good morning, Year 5. I hope you're all well. Uh, today, in our English lesson, we're going to be looking at suffixes. Um, but before we do that, I would like you to complete um, this starter, um, all to do with semicolons, so revising that knowledge uh, that we learnt last week. Um, so pause the video, and when you're ready um, to begin the lesson, press play. So today, as I've already mentioned, we're going to be changing nouns or adjectives into verbs by adding suffixes. And uh, this is one of the criterias on the Year 5 writing band. So first of all, I'd just like you to uh, take a moment to think of any suffixes you could add which would change a noun or an adjective into a verb. So just to refresh your memory, a noun is a thing or an object, an adjective is a describing word, and a verb is a doing word. So um, write Pause the video and write some down on some scrap paper and press play when you're ready. So don't worry if you didn't manage to um, think of many, um, because first of all, we will just uh, be doing a quick recap just to remind ourselves what a suffix is and what is a root word as well. And that will help us with today's lesson. Um, so, a suffix is a group of letters added to a root word to form a new word. And a root word is a word that makes sense on its own. So, um, without any suffixes, it would still make sense. So, today we're going to be adding suffixes onto root words. And the suffixes we're going to be adding to the ends of the words... So suffixes we would always put at the end of the words and prefixes we put at the beginning, but we're looking at suffixes. And the ones that we are going to be looking at are eight, eyes or if I. So take a moment to pause the video and think about any verbs that might end in those suffixes. OK, again, don't worry if uh, you had trouble thinking um, of verbs which ended in those suffixes, because that's what we're going to be focusing on today. Um, so before we move on to our first task, I'm just going to introduce some rules, some spelling rules, when we add these suffixes onto root words. So to begin, for words ending in Y, you need to change the I before adding the suffix. And our next rule, for words ending in E, you need to remove the E before adding the suffix. So I'm just going to move on to our next slide and I'm going to give you an example for these spelling rules. So for example, beauty ends in Y. Um, now if we um, add the suffix IFY, you will see that I have taken, I have removed the Y before adding the suffix. Or I have changed it into an I. Um, <clears throat> and in this example, active, I'm going to add the suffix eight, activate. You will have noticed again that I have removed the E so I've removed the E before adding the suffix eight. And we have changed the two nouns into verbs. So to beautify something is to make something more beautiful and to activate something is to start something. Right, so we're going to do a task now. Um, there are bronze, there's bronze, silver and gold tasks and you can select um, any of these based on how confident you are feeling. Um, use the words to help you form new ones with what you have learned about suffixes, eight, if I and eyes. So we're going to be changing these nouns or adjectives into verbs by adding those three suffixes that we've already talked about. Okay. Um, be very careful because they may not all work. Now, just say them out loud before making any decision. 
because even though you might not know what they mean, you might have already heard of them, and so some of them might not sound quite right, so you may need to have um, say it out loud and check and see if it makes sense. But don't worry if you don't understand what it means, because we will be exploring the meaning of these words later on in the lesson. Also, if you feel like you need more practice, you can always select um, another task of bronze, silver or gold just for some more practice. And then once you've finished, you can complete the challenge if you are feeling confident. OK, so when you are ready, pause the video and then when you are ready, press play for the answers. Right, so here are the answers, year five, um, for the verbs, the new verbs that we have formed through adding the suffixes. You will notice, for example, that pure, we have replaced the E with an I for adding the suffix, and glory, we have removed the Y before adding the suffix. Okay.